The popular Spanish language TV show Sábado Gigante is saying goodbye after 53 years on television. CBS4's Maribel Rodriguez, my colleague, was once a big part of the show and is here to tell us how the show actually changed her life. Right, Maribel? Elliot, he actually gave me my first break on television. I worked on the show as a spokesmodel, as you see there, for several years while I was in college. It was, I have to say, an amazing experience working with Don Francisco, whom I call the king of television, and the entire staff of Sao Gigante. He was a huge part of my life, and even though he will be saying goodbye, he will continue to be loved by his millions of fans. Pero también, Maribel, no solamente presentaba cosas, sino que hiciste también. It was he, Mario Kreutzberger, better known as Don Francisco, who gave me my big break on his television show, Sábado Gigante, and what a ride it was. It was a huge part of my career and my life. Yes, that was my husband. He proposed to me on the show. For six years, I was a spokesmodel on the longest-running variety show in television history. But after 53 years of laughter, music, tears, and off-the-wall contests, the family fun show Sábado Gigante will be coming to an end. The Chilean son of a Holocaust survivor fell in love with television while in New York studying to be a tailor. But when he returned home, had a change of heart and launched the show in 1962. Years later, he brought his talents to Miami and Univision began producing the show in 1986. He has been there ever since. He is known for his crazy comedies, dancing, singing, and for launching many careers like Sofia Vergara's. Don Francisco is a household name. Every Saturday, he enters millions of homes around the world. He is a part of a family tradition many will miss and never forget. And the last show is expected to be on September 19th. Univision is not saying why the show is being canceled. I have been told he will be making the announcement on his show tomorrow night. I love, love, love seeing that video of you on the show. Oh, my now, gosh. That was, I started in 1995, <laughs> and I was there until 2001. So that was several years I, ago. I have to say, I never worked uh, with Don Francisco, <laughs> but I did have the opportunity to interview him a number of years back. Mm -hmm. And he told me that he patterned his show after Let's Make yeah. a Deal and The Price is Right. He did it in Spanish, and he was so successful. And he really is a workaholic. He is. Wow, look at now? you. He has a vineyard in Chile, and he also works on on the telethon, which um, helps disabled children in Chile. He's been doing that for 30 years. He's raised millions of dollars. He will continue to do so here in the United States. And um, I'm sure he will not stop working. Univision says that he will continue to do special projects with He's Univision. He's done very so. well, and so have you. Thank you, Mary. Thank you. You too. <laughs> Thanks a lot. And that's our news for